Welcome to the Spread Hunter Daily Safari. Uh, today is uh, Thursday, uh, November 16th, and we're going to cover a couple of, uh, you know, the market had a really big move today, so we're going to co cover a couple of uh, spreads that really, really, really performed. Actually, one's an individual option and one is a spread. So let's get started with that. All right, there's a couple of trades that um, we were looking at yesterday um, during the day and up to the end of the day that really, really, really paid off today. Um, first one is in the SPY. We were looking at the 58.5, 59.5 spread, which was trading uh, right around a dime. I think it was trading 11 cents at the end of the day. And you can see right here that it closed at 38 today could go higher tomorrow, and it was higher during the day today. I think it was up in the mid-40s. Um, but that being said, the SPY had a 0.82% up move, and this particular spread that we're talking about had somewhere north of 350% gain for the day. So that's uh, indicative of the power of these options, and particularly these out-of-the-money options, the calls, um, you know, this market has done nothing but go up. So the strategy that people are focusing on is to look for inexpensive calls and uh, try and get the timing right. Um, the other part of the equation is volatility. So here's the UVXY, which is a um, double short vol. So you can see today as vol crashed. It went down a uh, dollar twenty-three, which is you know somewhere around seventy percent maybe. And um, the option that we were looking at yesterday was actually this fifteen. Let's see, yesterday's sixteen puts would have been trading the price of the fifteen puts. So um, you could have bought these these. You could have bought these 16 puts yesterday at somewhere near this level. Um, maybe it was four cents, five cents. I don't recall exactly where it was, but um, it was significantly under 10 and maybe under five. And you can see where they are today with the S U V X Y, um, you know, giving up the, the market, giving up its high, higher vol, which lasted for a few days during the course of the sell-off. But today, they just, you know, took it to the woodshed. And one of the hardest things in all of options trading is to be long volatility. Um, it's constantly eroding, and it's very, very, very expensive to stay long. So this is an indication. Um, I didn't write down the prices of these options, but I'm quite sure that what I'm telling you is that the 16 puts were trading closer to where the 15 puts are today yesterday because we were a point and a quarter higher. Um, so that's the two trades that really performed, and uh, that's what we had to focus on. All right, that's it for today.